Hi friends, it's hot dog season. So today we are going to make a chili hot dog tater tot casserole. Let's go. The first thing we need to do is make the chili. And for that, to get started, we need onions and celery. To my celery and onions, I am also adding three cloves of garlic. I love this gadget. I've been talking about it in my previous videos. I will link it down below as I do the recipe, as I do everything else that I talk about in my videos. Let's head over to the stove and get our chili going. It's super easy. I'm starting out with a pound of ground beef. Pepper. Now, after my meat, I know it's browned on one side, I'm going to add in the onions, celery, and garlic. tablespoon of sugar, tablespoon of yellow mustard, splash of Worcestershire sauce, chili powder, cumin, give it a stir, and when you stir it really smash up your beef. Stew tomatoes. up basically. I have a combination of tomato soup and tomato paste. You can use either or both. And a half cup of water. I'm just going to let this cook. I'm going to turn the temperature down and let it cook and simmer for just a little bit. But this is it. How easy is this? It smells so good. You can also at this point give it a taste test and see if you need to make any adjustments. I am going to do that as well, but I just need to wait until it cools down a little bit. It is really hot. Here's my nine by 13. I have greased it with a little bit of butter. If you have avocado oil spray or whatever kind of spray you like to use, do whatever you like. My chili is nice and thick now. And I am just going to put this in the 13 by nine. The next thing we need are the star of the show, the hot dogs. This is the brand that I love and prefer, Nathan's. 
I need to get them cut up. Now we just need to get the hot dogs combined with our beautiful chili that turned out so good. I did taste it. It didn't need a thing. I'm just going to give this a stir. Just to make sure the hot dogs get nice and coated with our beautiful chili. Okay, next I am going to do a layer of cheese. I have Colby Jack and cheddar. Use whatever combination of cheeses you like. The next layer is onions. I'm using a sweet Vidalia onion. I love onions on a chili dog, so this to me is just the perfect combination. Next up, we need tater tots. These are right out of the freezer. And we are going to layer these like so. I'm just going to pop this into our 350 degree oven. And after 30 minutes, we will put a layer of cheese on top and bake it for about another 10 minutes. And we will be back to do a little taste test. Okay, it is out of the oven. I topped it with some scallions. And look at this. So amazing. Let's give this a try. Mm. Wow. So good. Mm. Wow. If you love a chili dog and or if you love chili cheese fries, so good. Oh my gosh. This and this is just like summer in a casserole, basically. You could bring this to a summer party potluck. So wonderful. Really, really good. I love the sweet Vidalia onions in there too. And the tater tots, oh my gosh. Mm. It's Coney Island explosion. Really, really good. It's so fun to make. I think kids would love this. I think the whole if this is something that the whole family would love, like I said, that you could bring to a party. It's delicious. I just want to say thanks for joining me in the kitchen today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I can pop another video right here for you to check out between now and my next upload. Please subscribe to my channel, like this video. I upload every other day and I can't wait to see you next time.